Series 8 playoffs. Satoga on the CT side of Nuke 9Z. Just poking and prodding right now on the pistol round. Eventually Tartarzan is found out. And um, 9Z don't really have to make any commitments from here. Still so much time left remaining. They just can continue to rack up these kills. Yeah, this is quite brutal. This is literally just 9Z stamping down all forest on the map early, right? It's not, it's not a case of fighting all into one angle everyone has just gone for a solo pick and has won out their engagement immediately like this is actually just quite terrifying now on the site trying to hold firm but now he's actually the only player left and try's got a pretty good idea that he could be behind this doorway bomb gets planted nice shot he even shuts the door and his opponent trying to find a wait for the attention to be taken towards the stairs then he will peek out but that wow. just destroys him and he's going to be able to find the second kill here as well. That's probably round over for Rao rotating down MP9. He's able to get himself into the cubby. But was the drop down heard? That's the question. If he could at least find a kill here, that would be great. And there's actually a rotation that's come through from Landon as well. For Rao peeks out. He's found a kill, B-Dog. He's going to get mollied. That's the danger. Go straight to Davideus. And now Max is here too. At least, look, it's a two versus two. And both of these players are here. Ramp Landon hits the shot. That's what Soldier are worried about, but that reload, I was going to say that's costly, and it is. Davideus catches out both of them. They line up, and suddenly, Landon, who got the opening kill, now needs to close the show. A really tough clutch on his hands here, one versus two. Even though both of these remaining players, 4, 9, Z are low, doesn't matter when you have the AWP. Doesn't have a kit either. Timing great. Uh, don't know. He should, he should have rights. So we'll definitely get that sorted for you. Uh, but with that being said, good start for Sol Joga until they walk straight into Max's dual Berettas. At least Tatsin does trade and suddenly they have bombsite. Well, it's unlocked. Yeah, he's the only player on the bombsite right now. He's still waiting for his teammates to come through. Even one player looking to make his way up the vent. But Try has that cross undercover. And he finds a frag as a result. That's a really big kill coming through from him because it's just throwing a spanner in the works now for Sojoga. So have to focus on trying to recover the C4 before they can even try and get the bomb plant. Max is now backstabbing the player on the site itself. There's too many fights for the T site to try and take right now, but Tartizan will still best Max. This is really awesome. awkward. So awkward for both teams. Ooh, that's a great shot though. They know that the player's up towards heaven. Buddha, who's actually had the best start to, to life on Nuke, swings out. Squeaky, but his head gets taken clean off. And now Tatter's in. Well, he was trying to wrap heaven, but try accounts for it. Still will be traded out though. Really important trade coming through. CSO continues to play the patient game as well. Even though Sajogu didn't really have much going for them in the round, they still knew what was required of them. There was still a, a clear plan, which is now to try and get in towards the, say, bombsite. This is where one of the two AKs is positioned right now. I suppose the other is Galil. DGT waits for his opportunity to pounce. He's able to find the frag. Just looking to deny the bomb plant now. Oh, Landon remains so calm in the situation. Finds the kill, locks in the bomb plant. Now it's only Max left remaining. But du Duvis duck dives down the vent. Kills continue to go back and forth, but 24 seconds left on the clock, so Joga have to make a decision. Oh, maybe this is just going to be made for them. Look, the bomb's dropped tight in the open. That's very difficult to try and recover. CSO can grab this, but the, the vent player is just baiting the entire time. I and Davidus, it's the two orbs that are here right now, I believe. Davidus, Batal, one shot. Try doesn't realize the player's actually crossed, but it doesn't matter. Oh my goodness, himself and Davidus will combine to find three kills. Try actually doesn't escape. The molly is going to cost him his life and Landon trying to hide the defense. And Davidus, not blinded up by the flash, is able to keep his teammates alive. So Joga oh. funneled in towards the speed bomb site. Try. Well, he thrives. Perfect coming through from him. Multi kill to finish. That was an opening kill that just goes to begging. That was him taking initiative, feeling it out. Two players peek into him. He's actually. Oh my goodness, he finds the frag on both of them. Davidu says enough out of you. Eventually we'll put him to death. The one thing 9Z do have going for them here, B-Dog, is that two of their three players are over towards the correct side of the map right now. So Joga's still trying to force the issue in towards A. Tartison 
Is he going to get hunted out here? Max decides against peeking, which means he can't do anything about the bomb that makes its way down through lowers in towards B. Yeah, but look at this. Davideus pushed off the back of the info. Wow. And he even drops the bomb. 20 seconds left. Now it's a foot race to the B bomb site. Davideus just needs to survive, and he's on a little bit of an off angle. And he's going to roll in towards short. He's the one on the angle. Nice peek coming through from Landon. Pulls the crosshair off the angle. Able to get that, that kill between himself and Pharrell. Landon continues lead that charge in towards the B bomb site. Lots of missed shots coming through from the CTs. Eventually, Tri will get a kill. Notice there's a second looking to aggress. We will combine to find that frag. HE also chips down Landon. I mean, this was an eco round for Sajoga. Two versus two. This is very winnable for them as things stand. Landon aggressing. I think he's actually been able to play the situation really well. His game since has been on point. I don't think that the CTs realized that he's right. It's like there's a lot of opportunity to have those spaces. That is wild that Davideus still dinks Farrow. He does find his kill. kill. Yeah. I wasn't going to say it, but you did. Uh, <laughs> four on four. Bomb making its way towards B. And there's only really one defender here. Yeah, that's true. That's a huge gamble coming through from 9Z. And fairly unfounded gamble as well. It's not like a huge amount of information to play off of that they're making this call. DGC will pivot back in that direction after smoking up Monster Tunnel. Buddha could get caught in transition. Ashbang comes through all by design. Morph ahead of the smoke. Blinded by the flash. Man advantage restored for 9Z. I gotta go get the bomb. Bandit though hits the shot, but instantaneous trade out of Buddha. Again, 20 seconds, we've got this really yeah, late, late play coming in towards the heaven flank, but you're right, and it doesn't even matter if he gets the kills onto the B bomb site players, because you've still got Max in connector. Farrow, though, fires off a shot, Try hits the trade, and now you're worried about it, Try play. This is live, and this is fast, out B, Tatters in, overwhelmed, and so too oh my goodness. is just the rest of Sajoga. This is a brawl and a mauling from 9Z. This was the force pipe, just been completely dismantled. So Joga go all in, they hope for the best, and unfortunately it hasn't worked out, which means now uh, they're going to have to try and defend against map and series point with nothing to work with. At least Landon's recovered the M4A1S. He went on a bit of a mission there, and he will extract the rifle from the scene, but they're hot on his heels as they're trying to hunt him down. 15-2. Does kind of feel like I don't know, map one scoreline was inflated a bit more than it should have been. 9Z, it, it felt like they lost their way more than Sajog for some gunfights. Farrell going to be the next man up to the plate. He does have some wow. support from Landon, but they've just both been destroyed. And 9Z will waltz to victory here on Overpass. Called it before it's even been done. Bomb is going to make his way towards A. Max gets caught off guard. Two versus three. Try understands that they can be coming through connector, but the bomb makes out through long, which is so important. Davideus is already on the B bomb site, for goodness sake. That's going to pull Malf here, and uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> I look like we're going into highlights, but we're not done yet, guys. We're nearly there. Yeah, it is a formality. Davideus not going to be the player to finish off the job. Morph has been pretty good here on Overpass so far himself and CSO. They have been able to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with 9Z. But unfortunately, just two players pitching up is never going to be enough against the might of a full five-man roster. Everybody contributing for the side of 9Z. Morph charging his way forward, but it is inevitable. And fittingly, it's going to be tried to finish off the job. 22 kills in 18 rounds coming through from Try as 9Z lock themselves a spot into the corner finals as they make life work of Sajoga. Yeah, they look really